This is the moment when the pineal gland releases its metabolites. These are super chemicals that fit into the same receptor sites as serotonin and melatonin, but they carry a different message. Think of these metabolites as upgraded versions of melatonin that serve to heal the body, calm the mind, create a profound mystical experience, shut down the survival centers in the brain, and it increases energy in the nervous system. Now when this occurs, the person experiences hyperperception, and they usually have very profound mystical experiences. They have the feeling that they are experiencing another reality, more real than this one. Thus, in the dream of the internal world, all of their senses are heightened. If their senses are heightened, this means their awareness is heightened. And if their awareness is heightened, then their consciousness is heightened. And as we know, you can't have consciousness without energy. So the energy always rises in the brain and has been measured over and over again. The stronger the electrical activity entering the brain from the field, the greater that lucid inner event will be. And the greater the eternal event is, the more it will literally reshape the microstructure of the brain. It's a fact that these experiences enrich the brain and since experiences also create emotions the type of emotion the person is feeling is less chemical and or matter based and more like energy and frequency the energy of that elevated emotion translates into bliss exuberance joy etc and because the feeling is so thrilling and coherent the person pays attention to the experience in their mind now the brain is reorganizing new information so that we learn more about an entirely other aspect of the self the stronger the emotion from the inner event, the more you pay attention to the pictures in your mind. And this creates long-term memories, thus building a bigger memory bank than who we are or what we know in this three-dimensional reality. Now research shows that the heightened emotions are being experienced in a part of the brain called Bronman's Area 30. This is an area of the brain responsible for profoundly joyful and loving experiences that create long-term memories. In past measurements, scientists have observed a person's oxytocin levels elevate, causing them to report feelings of more wholeness and love, 